Hi, I'm Tracy Matthews of Flourish and Thrive Academy. And today I'm here to talk about the secret to making more money by doing less yourself. Okay, right about now you're probably thinking, I have no idea what you're talking about. How could one possibly make more money by doing less? Over the past several years, I've come up against several roadblocks that you might be able to relate to. For years, I had a team of designers and support for Tracy Matthews Designs. When I started over, I was going back to basics and doing everything, dealing with customer support, sales, designing, shipping, and all of my website updates, etc., and just about everything else in between. I was running things on such a shoestring budget that I didn't even hire a bookkeeper to handle my books at first. As soon as I could, I started to outsource the aspects of my business that did not need my direct attention. Almost immediately, my time was freed up to do the things I loved, like designing and working with clients. Step by step, I added more people to my team, including Peter, who's been working with me for the past five years for the most part. I feel like I spent a lot of time trying to convince designers in the Flourish and Thrive community to start outsourcing parts of their business, but they resist like crazy. Yes, there is a monetary component involved. You have to take on an added expense. But for those of you who remain unconvinced, let me offer one final plea before I get to the core of this video. If you have a collection, a newsletter, one or more social media profiles, a website, or even just plan to start working on one of these things sometime in the near future, you are ready to start outsourcing. Okay, now for those of you who are already convinced that you need to begin considering your outsource options, but have no idea where to start, I'm going to teach you how to tell the difference between activities you should outsource and those that you should be doing yourself. Take all of your activities and assign a value to them. All right, so which of these tasks are five, 20, 50, 100, or $500 an hour plus tasks? Here are some examples of five to $50 an hour tasks. Website updates, extensive social media, research, administrative work like filing and shipping, bookkeeping, time-wasting activities like obsessively checking texts or email messages, making every piece of jewelry for every single order. Now, here are some examples of $500 an hour tasks. Sales, emails, and calls, PR pitches, client follow-up and customer service that facilitate the sale within reason, strategic partnerships or alliances, financial strategy, collection development and pricing, business development like learning and implementing skills that will help you grow your business. So as you can see, the five to $50 an hour tasks are rather menial and not very important in actually generating sales. Whereas the $500 an hour activities each carry the potential to generate a ton of revenue. For some reason, it's really common for jewelry designers to try outsourcing the high value tasks first. They go hire a sales rep or a super expensive PR company and then waste their time on the low value tasks. But that's exactly the exact opposite of what you should be doing. Get an assistant who can help manage your website and post to social media. They're everywhere, I promise. So you can focus on bringing in the big bucks. And as a final note, eventually you may choose to outsource some of those $500 an hour tasks. For example, you may hire a sales team or a business advisor, but keep in mind there are a few skills that you have that you absolutely cannot be replicated. These include your design intuition, your story and your personality, and your vision for your brand. These are all things that make your business your business and should never be outsourced. Now we wanna hear from you. In the comments below, tell us the following. Have you started outsourcing yet? And what tasks can you outsource so you can focus on generating revenue? If you found this video useful, make sure you like the video, follow our channel, and share it with your friends. Then pop on over to flourishthriveacademy.com for more jewelry business advice and free training. And if you want to learn more about creating freedom and revenue for your business, make sure you join us for our free training series called From Overwhelmed to Freedom. Click the link below this video to enroll.